Welcome to the world's biggest metro system. Welcome to Shanghai. Or should I say, welcome to the future. Just take a look at this station. I've been to a lot of metro stations through, throughout China in different cities. I've been to Chengdu one, uh, Shenzhen one, Guangzhou, Guiyang. I've been to loads, you know. But China just keeps on outdoing itself, you know. Each one I go to, it just gets better and better. Look at this. We're back again. Back once again in a science fiction movie. This is not science fiction. China made it science fact. The design is amazing. It goes through a range of colors. Before we get started, I'd like to say a huge thank you to Surfshark VPN for sponsoring this video. Now more than ever, our internet reliance has been rapidly increasing from streaming our favorite shows to keeping in touch with our loved ones. And also our banking is mostly done online these days. We'd like to think that our information online is safe, but you never know when America is listening in on one of your calls. <laughs> and so as our online footprint increases, so does our need for proper security. Surfshark is a VPN service that protects your information by encrypting all the data that you send through the internet, keeping anyone unwanted from seeing it. Another great reason to use a VPN is because content from streaming services can be restricted based on what country you're in. With Surfshark, you can solve that problem by simply changing your location. And you can access a bunch of different libraries, for example, on Netflix or on Disney+. Plus. So if you want both protection and freedom online, click the link in the description below and use my special code. Here we are. You'll get an extra three months for free. Surfshark offers a 30-day money-back guarantee, so there's no risk. You can try it out for yourself. Go and try it now. Thank you, Surfshark. So this is line 14. We're currently at Yuyan Garden, right? And this is the deepest metro station in all of Shanghai. We are 36 meters underground right now. Just think about that for a second. China built this 36 meters underground. <laughs> what is going on? So you can see on the screen there uh, when the train arrives, it's just arrived now, and then the, when the next train is, and the third train is coming, and then also on the bottom, you can see the capacity, how full each carriage is. That is crazy. I don't know how, how is it, how is it detecting that? So you can choose, and you can choose one of the uh, emptiest carriages. Right, let's get inside the train. And I have heard that this train is also fully automated. There's no driver. So let's go take a look. Everyone's just uh, heading, heading uh, back home. It's uh, rush hour. Wow, well, look at this, no driver. Oh, I'm at the back. I should have gone to the front. Oh, we've got a little window there, the tunnels. in the wrong way. <laughs> and we have arrived at the next station. That was pretty fast, it was like two or three minutes. Uh, we're now at Lu Jia Sui. Let's get off the train now. Wow, look at this, all the people just coming in at uh, the entrance. So this line was built to relieve passenger flow pressure from line two. And you can see uh, all the passengers that would have been on line two, but now they're using this line instead, you know. China's always, always improving people's lives. Look, look at all these people using this convenient uh, public transport system. And then just look at this station. Each uh, station that you get off on has a, a different kind of style. 
No need for a ticket, just scan your phone like this. And we're away, we're free. I just popped outside now just to get a glimpse of my favorite building in Shanghai. Oh, I guess my three favorite buildings, hold on. Trees are in the way. Wow, look at that, that is just insane. The Shanghai Tower, uh, the Jim Mao Tower, and the SWFC. China's infrastructure is just, you know, it's, it's uncomparable. Shopping malls, metro systems, crazy skyscrapers. I'm just trying to head outside now on a bridge to get a good shot of all the skyscrapers. And then we're gonna go back in, back into the metro. More metro, more station hunting. <laughs> I have got some good timing today. It is, uh, the sun is just setting. Wow, look at this. Ah, there's the, uh, the Pearl Tower there. That's also one of my favorite buildings in uh, Shanghai. Wow, look at this. I mean, you really do feel like you're walking in the future you're like walking in a science fiction movie oh i just walked in front of someone's picture wow look at that the sunset oh my goodness gracious me i've got perfect timing today wow. oh there's another view of the uh, three towers this is amazing Meanwhile, in America. Oh man, you don't realize how hot it is in Shanghai because you spend most of the time in shopping malls like this. It's got the AC on. And then also in the metro you have the AC and so you get used to it. It's only until you come outside and it's like boom hits you. It's so hot in Shanghai at the moment. Whew. Back in the metro now and you may have noticed throughout this video that I'm taking the stairs not using the uh, escalators. I'm taking the healthy option because you might have seen in that last video that I ate so much street food and I gained 10 kilogram of weight so I've got to burn it off. <laughs> Oh my god, look at this. So this is just kind of a walkway to to get to the station. Look at this, look at this screen. It's crazy. So clear as well. Meanwhile, in America. And once again, uh, another kind of style again. Oh, this one's kind of just a straight white line. I like it though, it's kind of minimalistic. And once again, you may have noticed throughout this entire video and all the places that I went, everywhere, spotless, clean, safe, little kiddos running around. No homeless people, no beggars sat around. If this was the UK, there'd be a beggar like on each one of these posts all the way or some homeless person just sleeping. Is there any here? You can see the map there. I mean, just look at all those stations. That is just insane. Um, and Shanghai Metro System is the world's biggest metro system by route length, totaling 802 kilometers. It's also the second biggest by number of stations with 408 stations on 19 lines. And the train has just arrived. I better hurry up. I'm gonna miss it. I am now at Jing An Temple Station. This is uh, on line two. Now this is a bit of a, a classic uh, station. Uh, it was built in 2000. It's 23 years old. Um, and I actually remember uh, taking this line a lot in 2011 when I used to live in Shanghai. I always used to take line two. So I'm having fun. I'm taking a trip uh, down memory lane. I'm having fun memories of my, my old uh, commute on line two. Um, but even though it's 23 years old, look at this. Is it crumbling? Is it like run down, worn out? No, it's been maintained over those 20 plus years. Meanwhile, in America,
Line 2 is one of the longest and one of the oldest lines on Shanghai Metro and it's also one of the busiest. Uh, so like I was saying, uh, Line 14 was built to try to uh, relieve the, uh, the passenger flow of uh, this line. Station. This is Wuzhong Road. Look at this. It's like we're on some kind of Starship Enterprise. <laughs> Let's head up here. Oh my god. Oh my god. I just spot. What the? What on earth? <laughs> what the hell? Whoa. Oh my god. Oh my god! What the hell? It's like some futuristic kind of... I don't know what to call it, like a like an aircraft hangar and the spaceship just flies in and lands here. <laughs> oh, that is crazy. Ah, you can see the... Um, there were the three towers that I just showed you. And the uh, Oriental Pearl Tower. Wow, this is amazing. China just keeps, they just keep outdoing themselves, every station. <laughs> right, let's head outside now. It is now 8 p.m. I came in, <laughs> I came in here uh, at 4 p.m. I mean, I've been checking out all these stations for four hours. Um, okay, this one or this one? This one or this one? Okay, take the healthy stairs. Healthy stairs, here we go! Here we go! Oh, I made it. Okay, and we're back out on the streets of Shanghai. Oh, it's a bit dark here. Can you see me? Right, anyway. That is the end of this video. And I'll see you in the next one. And now I'm really out of breath. Signing off. Signing off.